All right, we finished the granary, so we do have now some potato and flowers in there. And what I also want to have is, I want to move the forester now. So we do have lots of wood here. So what I'm doing is first, I'm building the forester, a new one, and then I'm going to get rid of this one here. We can get the wood then to the warehouse here. So we do have some workers there and wood is what we actually really do need. So hopefully they fill it with wood. And up here, somewhere in the forest then, I want to have the forest tree. We need to move those because this is more and more getting like a central part of the village and city then. You know, so this is getting more important here, this district there. And also that field here will have to move then. So the forest tree. There it is. And just up here, somewhere in the forest where it belongs to. Or we could also have it up here. I think that's also a good idea. Yeah, actually let's have the forest tree over here. That's not so bad. Here where we have the forest. So people can then work over here and we can get rid of this one here in the middle of everything. And then the charcoal pile. Um, we can also say to this one now, since it's already emptying, make empty. Right, so the charcoal, we can then go for the warehouse there and yeah, store it here. Something like that. Forestry, and then we can get rid of those two buildings there because they don't look so good here anymore. That's what I want. And then we can, we could, yeah, be moving the field. So let's get rid of the field here. Off it goes. And from the cow shed, we can take then the field up here. So it's more or less up here in the forest mountain then, something like that. And there we have then the cows living. At the moment, we don't have any, unfortunately. There we have the cow shed. And for the farm, I want to have a few more fields than here, just where the cow shed then also is. We can have another field. Oh, and we're already building one here, right. And it's November. Food supply is fine. The only thing that's not fine is where the hell are the potatoes? No more potatoes. Seems like there was an empty harvest with that. And here what I can see is there's already a path forming. So what we should also do is not having a bench, but having a fence. And I would really like to have a fence then here. Yeah. like this and then we have a fence here anyway so people have to go this path here they have to take this path there and not go to the river down there let's do this oops let's do the same thing let's actually make it going down yeah like this because here the the, the, the space kind of like ends and here we have the village house and then probably another one here and definitely village houses here then something like that yeah this is looking fine. Then we can actually have two of them here. So we finish this block here of houses too. And up here we have the cows and then we have the farms. Fishing docks are looking fine. Do we have enough fish? Yeah, we do have enough fish. We have 50 fish, but yeah, now during winter, obviously it stops. Beautiful. Also quite atmospheric with the music in the background. Now, um, iron is something that we need to import, um, chickens and cows. We do have the money for that. And I would also like to get a second nail or a second smithy that we need. So we already have one. And yeah, actually, since we get rid of the forest tree, I'm inclined to go with the smith smithy here then, you know, here in the town center. Um, where we have the bridge then also connecting to it. And I do like the idea of having then a kind of like a main road going up here into the village. 
So the charcoal pile is empty. We do need a second one though. We do need one. Um, where was it? There it is. So we do need one. Yeah, here where we have then the forester. So it's over here now. That's fine. So we can get rid of this one here. Demolish. And once the forestry up here has been built, we can then get rid of this building here and having a smithy here instead. That's working. Hmm, I just check uh, my goods there. Food-wise, it's not looking good. I think we'll need to import some food. Let's go to the map here and send a message over here. Perhaps they offer something, some food. We do have lots of wheat, so we have endless supply of flour, basically. We produce that, but nothing else. No potatoes. That's something we can't allow to happen again, so I'm going to check it um, specifically the next year. We also have these plows up here, but they need an ox, and we don't have that yet. Oh, great. We sent someone, and now they have someone themselves. There's some cows, at least. Let's get some cows. Let's see. Three. Let's have four cows. Deal. That's milk. That's important. We could also get some iron here. Right, and what I definitely desperately need to do, wait a second, instead of that, we do need to have a fellow somewhere. Hemp, weed, we have so much weed, it doesn't really matter, right? Because I don't want to do the same mistake again, we do need, desperately actually, food for the cows. So hay, that is something, and I'm inclined to go with this one here, that we have the fellow. Right, this one's the fellow, and then we do need a haystack or something like that. Hay dryer, produces hay from nearby grass. And that's something we can then have. Yeah, probably here, but... Let's remove the field there again. I do need the hay dryer. And we can place it in here somewhere. It's there immediately from nearby grass. And then we have the pasture here. Right, for the cows, that's working. And I think I cannot abort that offer here or that order here because the cows of course we can't use them yet because I don't have any people I don't have any field for them at the moment so hopefully we can do this quickly here it's taking a long time for those trees to chop down and I wonder what they're building right now What are they building? That is the question. I can't check that right now. I think here we are building something. All resources have been collected. I would like to put these two on hold for now. The charcoal kiln is working again. And the forest tree. That's still something that needs to be built. We don't even need to chop down anything for it. So over here. They delivered that still. But here the forest tree. No one's building anything it seems. And I have no idea why, because I'm not building anything. Or I didn't order anything. Messenger arrived, let's have a look. Live chicken, that's important, so we can get something there. Let's get some live chicken, we do have enough space and I do need more eggs.
But I would really love to know what they're building right now. No construction site is used. I hope it's not a bug that's happening right now. Yeah, now they're starting to build it. Forestry. We only need some nails there. We do have enough nails. Once again, it's a long winter. Our chicken should arrive soon. Right, and then we have 10 chicken and we have enough wheat and enough water for them. So everything that my chicken need. That is fine. Another family is moving out. Oh, well, for the first time, a family is moving out. And we have the space, though, so someone should be moving in again. I think it's because due to high rent or something, but we know. Who knows? Let's put four workers in there. So this forestry is now empty then. Make it empty. And we can get rid of the workers here. They can go up here then to that forestry there. Yeah. And now they rush to make those, to make it empty and they should then go to the warehouse and get the wood over there. Yeah. And they're emptying it, but there are lots of wood in there and firewood and stuff like that. New family is in here, new family is moving out again. Right now, not enough food variety. It really hits us now that we don't have any, um, that we didn't receive any potato there or something like that. But we do have now more chicken. Can we slaughter them? No. Okay. We really can't use, uh, only can use them for the eggs that we would have with them. Okay. More families are moving out now. So let's lower the taxes there the village the house rent there to two let's make it two only for now our winter is really taking a long time but it's the end of february now so the snow should be melting soon there it starts There's a new family coming then. And for some reasons also we're not chopping down the trees here. Another family is coming there again soon. Uh, good. No more families are moving out. So I think the rent of two is fine for the moment. Um, and what we need really is, yeah. We cannot unfortunately put a work area in there, so I cannot say now, please take away those trees here because we need the field. That is not working somehow. All right, and this year, that's very important. How is it looking now with the sowing? Hopefully we can do that. It seems like they want to sow all the fields at once. Right, and of course that takes a bit of time there now. And this year, for some reasons, there's no one uh, helping them. So it's only really those workers there. Yeah, so in this case here, it's obvious now that one farm is not enough anymore. You know, so we really do need a second farm there with more workers for some reasons now once again like last year um there's this bug now it seems that no one wants to work 
or wants to help because usually what happens is that this one here is full this list here is full of people helping them and for the second time in a row no one is doing it no one is helping that is a bit frustrating because i think we will once again be not able to have all the fields here active Especially the potato. No one is helping. That's really strange here. Cannot do anything there. Let's see. Higher options. Nope. There's nothing I can do. The manager is not doing anything here, so there's no use having her, what I can see. Hemp will be full, this is full, this is full, this is not full, this one's not, oh boy. Now that is really strange what's going on there. Now we do have some workers, but now it's only almost too late then. You know they're doing it over here now. And perhaps they can still do it then here. That's the potatoes. There we have another field now, so I would like to have potatoes here as well. Okay, the uh, forestry is also empty soon. Okay, very good. At least he's doing it now for those potatoes there. And I think we can demolish this one now. 12 more locks are in there. Okay, so this potato field here will be full as well. And they are sowing this one here now too. That's really good. So there, there will be a good harvest this year. And this one's empty now, so we can get rid of this forestry there. Demolishing it, getting some nails back, hopefully, and something like that. Very good. Hopefully that's going to be a good harvest. Yeah, I will need to build a second farm soon. It worked up to this point, like last year it didn't work and now it almost wor didn't work again. This year though, every, every field has been sowed here, so, you know, this year it worked perfectly fine. Now what I also need is the hay dryer then here, so I think we will get a fellow... I don't know how to get any hay at the moment, so we'll see about that. There's another field that needs something. And the forestry is then gone too. Very good. One of my... Actually, that was my first building. Let's make this resource stack there empty. I think we have now lots of wood. Oh, yes, in the warehouse. 20,000. Right, and that means now we can have another smithy here because I want to have a second one for more nails. We do need so many of them. And we can then have the smithy here. Right, and we can then have another building here if we want to, or here in that corner there. Shoemaker, salary, something like that probably. We do have, we don't have enough ham for that. Tannery produces leather from heights. Now those heights, I think we have, yep, yeah, in the slaughterhouse so that we need the pig style. So that is another, another big um, production chain that we still need. Yeah, but that's it for now. So we have the smith here and there, those streets here will disappear then over time. We have the bridge here. Now we can then connect the bridge here, going then to the bridge, the fence. Like so, and up here we can then form a new street then. It's going to take a bit of time there. And what I can see is we do have now lots of nails and no houses. So we can continue building those houses again. 
also this one here. Right? So that we have three more houses coming up there. And this field should then also lose some of its um, trees. And nope, we don't... Or there is no um, unlocking or something like that. Everything is available from scratch, I think. So that makes it a bit more difficult in the beginning to uh, figure out what you need. Um, but once you have that, everything's here. And I don't think more buildings will unlock, so... I think this is then the last production chain that we have, and then it's just re repetition. So you build more houses um, with more people coming then. Oh, and a messenger. Offers cows, iron. Oh yes, iron might be good. Let's get some iron there. 800 for, yeah, for 100 coins. And that's it, actually. I mean, he would offer me cows, um, but right now I don't want to risk that again. Oh, and what I can see, hay dryer has grass on it. So this is working. I think we do need a second one then. A second hay, hay dryer. We could have it over here. Right, and then we do need something to store the hay. Whoops, not this. Hay barrack, there it is. Yeah, and that fits in here to the cow shed then perfectly. And once this is full, we can then order some cows. Something like that. And the smithy is also now in queue. But it takes a bit of time there for those things now to finish. For some reasons we don't have that many workers. Most of them are working now. Forestry, we don't need that many logs and wood. So we can push them away here. This one here, does, this one doesn't need four workers there. The farm does it though. So cow shed at least has some hay now. And then we can really go for the cows. And since we have so many nails, I'm also inclined soon to go with the bridge here. The wooden bridge. And I hope those boats can then still, you know, swim beneath the bridge then. Alright, all resources are con collected, so this one here can be built now. Yeah, and they're starting with that, so a new house is coming up here. And yeah, it's a pretty good idea that you can just rotate the buildings freely. It's like with Planet Zoo where you also don't have a grid or something like that. So you can just place those buildings everywhere you want to and, you know, align them however you want to. But also that, of course, has, um, has the disadvantage that you really need to know where to place the buildings. So grid system is a good help, a good supporting system like in Anno where you have the grid system. And I like it too. Because it makes it easier to build stuff. With the free rotation, yeah, you really need to know where to place it. It's, there is no help. You know, it's like an empty white page and you need to know where to place it. The grid is definitely a big help there. There's the next village house coming up. I think we do have now housing available. Very good. So people should be moving here. Did we get more iron? Yes, we have a thousand iron now available. There's the next house coming up. And the field here still needs lots of trees that need to be removed. All resources are collected. It's somehow a bit slow how we build it right now. So it used to be faster. 
the way you can build stuff. There, there's the next house coming up now. Right, and they're getting rid of the trees here though. So nine trees are left for the cow field. Hello. 